Yo, what's going on? It's your man, Stick God Travels. Today, we're here with another cigar review. Today, we got something special for you. We have the Essential Blend Number no. 1 from OM Cigars. It's got beautiful band, beautiful artwork on the band. There you see the OM Cigars, long filler, handmade, uh, gold band on the foot, nice, dark, beautiful wrapper. Um, and on this blend, we have a uh, Habano Vuelta Riba wrapper, a Palado Cubano binder, and for the filler we have Criollo 98, Nicaraguan, and Pennsylvanian fillers. So that makes for an interesting blend. I've never had this blend before. Uh, this will be my first time smoking it and I'm pretty excited because it seems like just from the description there's a lot going on with this one so um, without further ado let's get it split lit and see what we're working with let him cook let him cook I said let him cook <laughs> comes in a 52 by 6 torpedo. MSRP runs at about $12 per stick. And this is number one of six blends, if I'm not mistaken. And he also has a um, one that's unreleased that he sent me um, as a kicker and a, ta a taste tester. It's very, very good. Already I'm getting a lot of leather coming through. Let these flavors marry a little bit more. It was super hot today. Now it looks like I'm about to get a little rain. Hopefully I can finish this review before it comes in. Um, but I hear the drops. Very smooth, smooth, smooth so far. Hope everyone's having a blessed day. I can't say it's living up to his name already. Um, it is a full strength cigar. open from the beginning. I mean, it didn't have any problems with it. Starting to get a lot more smoke now as these um, tobaccos marry. Hmm. Yeah, off the top, I'm getting heavy leather there. Just a little bit of spice, not too much.
heavy leather, a little bit of spice, a little bit of cocoa. Smooth, kind of bitter on the long finish. some quick adjustments to the camera there. Not very heavy on the pepper, slight pepper in there. Um, definitely a full flavor blend, um, full strength, but not super peppery, which is, which is a bit surprising with, uh, with the lineup of fillers that we got there. Very tasty smoke. Sweet on the long finish. Looks like just a little bit of sweet and spicy touching my palate on the long finish. Very good so far. Construction's pretty good on this. Nice dark oily wrapper. Um, yeah, pretty good. I love the Criollo 98. Um, it always makes for a interesting add to a blend. Uh, one of my favorites. Yeah. Shout out to Extra Customs, man, for the cup. It's pretty dope. Love the gift. It's Extra Customs, man, on Instagram. I'll drop a link in the uh, description. Yeah, this is going pretty good so far, man. Um very complex cigar uh, picking up a little bit of uh, cinnamon and spice there now maybe a little bit of dark plum on that back end heavy heavy leather but I like it Yeah, on that retro hell, not too spicy. Uh, it's a lot of leather right now. We're gonna smoke it on down and see what we got. This is a very versatile blend. You know, the construction on it is very nice. As we venture down into the second third here, you know, I'm, I'm getting a little bit of earthiness now, uh, maybe peaked. As we get off into the second third of this cigar here, um, I'm seeing the versatility and I'm understanding more of what he was trying to do with these 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 fillers from three different worlds. I'm getting uh, a little cocoa in there, a lot of leather still, a little bit of sweet black licorice in there. Um, on the long finish, it still got that sweet aftertaste, which is very pleasant. Smoke texture is very, very smooth. Uh, again, it speaks to the versatility of the cigar because it's full for a second and then it's medium for a second. It's full for a second and it's medium for a second. And it's it's keeping me interested. It's keeping me logged into this cigar and wanting to know what's coming next. So a very concentrated um, approach to this blend. I can tell that a lot of thought went into this and a lot of time. Um, so far, so good, man. I'm loving it. I'm going down through the
the second third and I'll get back with you guys in the final. All right, guys, we've reached the final third of this one. Uh, still smoking good. Uh, rapper kind of fell apart on me, but absolutely still smoking good. Amazing. I didn't expect anything less. I've had the other blends and they all were great. Um, especially the Unbanned Special Blend. I loved it. Uh, a lot of heavy leather and pepper now, but it's kicking in right where it needs to, right here towards the end uh, when I'm finishing up and I need the biggest nicotine rush to come through. Uh, yeah, this is a good finisher cigar for your night. You know, if you're out somewhere or if you're just hanging around the house watching football or whatever you're watching, great cigar to have, man. Great cigar. Still got the cocoa notes in there, uh, a little dark chocolate. Still sweet, surprisingly, on the long finish. So that is absolutely a plus. Shout out to Osvaldo over at OM Cigars. Great blends you got here. I like what you're doing. I like how you're mixing it up. Um, changing the game up with these different blends. Um, not just seeing the same thing, you know, over and over again. You, you, you're, you're making our palate stink, is what I like to say. And uh, anything that makes the taste buds jump is is always a good, a good vibe, you know. So, yeah, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of this. I rate this cigar magna cum laude. Uh, definitely will buy it again. The blend is impeccable. All the blends are impeccable, but this one. It's great. Uh, I see what everybody was raving about. Um, yeah, I love it, man. And uh, if you've had it, let me know down in the comments what you thought about it, what you feel about it. Um, still got a little bit of the black licorice hanging around. Man, I barely want to put it down. The retro hell is still sweet. Yeah, this is a nice, nice cigar, man. I'm going to sign off, and I appreciate all y'all for watching this review. Again, this has been Stick God with the Essential Blends number one from OM Cigars. Uh, as I said before, if you've had it, let me know how you feel about it down in the comments. Uh, I'll put the link down for the cups that I showed you earlier. Uh, great cigar, man. Great cigar. Peace.